more you put that through, are we going to be able to connect okay. the next yeah, one gotta, that crosses yeah, over? Yeah, the we, answer is no. So let's no, get the straight one to go ball. across okay. first. Okay. We're going to make it work. Come on, let's make it work, guys. But that Frankie is a loud voice. Frankie, middle. keep your voice down. So when we upsell somebody on whatever the... Hey, what are the prices of the upsells? Um, yes, I do. Yes, yes I do. Uh, for, uh, for, uh, uh, That's okay. That's okay. So... I think one thing to consider is, I know we lost, but it was by $65. What happened to your voice? I would promise to do whatever it takes to work for you. Okay. I lost my voice working for you it's at the right. car wash. Now for the first time tonight, you see who Frankie right. Suits is about. You show us. Listen to me. This is how we do it back at home. Number one. <laughs> Frankie Suits. <laughs> A sexy swimsuit for any beau. This piece is not for the faint of heart. Out comes Carrie. <laughs> I mean, I again, I'm gay, but what a shock it was. He's got nipples erect, his fiercest runway walk. And granted, the guy looked good, but literally, they needed to get a fire extinguisher on that runway because he flamed it up. I mean, on fire. I'm claustrophobic. I'm sleeping outside every night. I won't even go in the tent. It's all right. You'll be back at the Bronx very soon. Don't worry about it. What's your reaction if, if Johnny comes back here? Johnny just comes back here. Everyone, what are you gonna do? My right. job will drop. Wait, 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 are you gonna just turn around? What are you talking about, Johnny? Our teammate that we call Johnny. Johnny. Oh. We came up with a name for Michelle. We just refer to her as Johnny, and the reason why she's Johnny is because she's an annoying person. Johnny, come lately, that annoying, non-productive girl. No, no, if that happens. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> if only she was nice to everyone. What do you guys think of when you think of uh, LA? What does everybody think of? Movie stars? What else? <laughs> do you think of bad microphones? Yeah. Yeah. I, microphones? It was the microphone situation that caused me to feel dread and true misery. And we had an hour and 28 minutes to go. All right. Chateau Marmont is most famous for is the location where the legendary John Belushi passed away after injecting a speedball full of drugs and overdosed. I probably should have left the John Belushi trivia out. When it was the first thing that popped into my mind about the Chateau is that that is where John Belushi died. I definitely should have left out the heroin part of it. There, there were children around. There may have been a moment when a child after the Taras, their, their dad, what, what's a speedball? Uh, yeah. Awkward. Do you know that Miss Julia Roberts does not have a star? Uh oh. Uh -oh. Right. Hello. Hi, this is Andy calling from Mr. Trump's office. Hello, Andy. Since Michelle quit, Mr. Trump feels no one else on her team deserves to be fired. Mr. Trump has canceled the boardroom. Woo! Yes! 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 What's up? Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Goodbye, good night. Take care. Oh, yeah! Bye, guys. There you go. That's what cheese noodle is? No, I put chips in mine. You never heard of a cheese doodle? What is a cheese doodle? A cheese doodle? What is that? You gotta be kidding me. You never heard of a cheese doodle? You're on crack. I'm delirious. You never heard of a cheese doodle? We're in LA. What language are you speaking? Did you ever hear of a cheese doodle? Of course I've heard of a cheese doodle. In New York, we call them cheese doodle. I can't see. No, 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 no. Hey, so we guys been drinking. We got a couple. Then you've been drinking. Hey, this team doesn't drink. We take things serious. You want a beer? Beer or no, wine? I'm all right. 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 Here, here. Have a seat. We got. We got the. We we have a warm fire and we have lots of wine. Come on, let's really. The fire is so much warmer. Yeah. Hey, Taylor, let's play a little song, guys. Oh, it's good. A lot of things just don't impress me. Tim was like awesome on the piano. Tim was actually, I mean, very, very impressive. Tim's definitely not going to be single anymore after this. <laughs> <laughs> Nicole, you better move fast. Easy. 
I think Tim's a good looking guy. And everybody's saying that there's a connection there. Yeah, yeah, Tim's cute. Like, yeah, Tim's a nice guy. Like, but I don't know what's going on. What could we have done better? Chicken soup. Huh? You really think that? I don't okay. know. Mr. Trump, I'm going to vocalize my opposition when I think it's important. And I have felt a little bit like I'm, you know, when I say something, it's being dismissed or they don't want to hear it. Or because I'm not, it's not true. Mr. Trump. We have and I am a team okay, player, Mr. Aaron. Trump. I got behind this Marissa, team. Marissa, shut up. Tim had to just make sure they were filled up with honey. All eight pumps shoot at one time. Like that. Stop! 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 It got backed up! What do you want from me? Poor Tim, he just couldn't do it. There was definitely no honey bottling class at Harvard. You clogged up the whole line. All our bottles are gonna be sticky pushing you. Are we ready? There we go. Stop! Stop! Red! Oh, uh, what are you doing? Why does it do this? You're reaching. Go down there. Get the hell out of here. You're, go, to, go, go down. You can't even put syrup in a bottle. It's so cute. Wow, Tim is getting so, like, just frustrated. The bottles are in place. I'm ready to go. And then Tim and Frank just started going at it back and forth. Probably the funniest thing I've ever seen. But we want them to pile up. They're going to pile up here. And when they gonna... pass this, it's going to shoot. No, they does and it shoots over here, you just idiots. Go. I think the fact that AeroCorp can just really have a good time no matter where we are or what the situation just shows our passion and just that we're happy people in general. Because of Tim, we'll finish this tomorrow. Frank, I'm going to pour honey on your ugly, fat face. Okay, good, good. This sucks. It makes me hate camp so much more knowing what the other team gets, knowing all the luxuries of the other side, and we're living like dogs over here. Seriously, it's not even funny anymore. It's got to end. We have to win. I, ah! <sighs> it's just absurd. In the car, clearly, I talked about it. I said it was my skill set. And then we got in there. I'm like, why aren't you guys listening to me more? <sighs> I'm going to break something. He said I was in charge of marketing, and that never happened. That's the only thing I'm upset about. He lied. Yes, that's the only thing I could possibly be upset about. Nothing else. None of you guys, nothing. Just don't lie. It's the only thing we all said. We all have our integrity. We all have jobs to go back to. We have reputations. Don't lie. When Surya and Nicole returned, Surya's eyes were like here. I mean, his just eyes were popping out of his head. His veins were all over the place. He was just like, you know, his hair was extra, you know, he was like electric. He was just, uh, he was really fired up. I have no problem. So I don't think no he, problem was, he was not charge. lying. He was okay, not I won't lying. take it personally. Don't take it like that. He was not lying. Just so. He was, I couldn't decide if he wanted to like punch someone or cry or kick the wall, but he was really fired up. And, you know, my first thought was, uh, I have to deal with this energy that's just annoying. I think after what happened in there, I, I, I need to be project manager of this task. I think, Not, I'm gonna, on. I think that you will be fantastic. You're going to be such we a win. huge part of the win tomorrow. We it's, will it's, win. It's, there is nothing, nothing I love more than to be the underdog. And right now, I feel like that. I feel like the cards are all stacked against me. The odds are against me. Each of you can show so much leadership okay. if you own your area. And that's what I want to do tomorrow. You guys are freaking brilliant. I'm going to be project manager with the team after a lot of dissension. Less than 12 hours later, I'm going to have to go out there and I'm going to have to lead this team. I've got to do incredibly well, and only then does it matter. Until then, I've got to prove myself in a big way. I want to go out there now, and I want to sleep for four days until we win. Okay, you have no perfect. idea because how much. I will just, I'll bleed for this team if I have to. I'll do anything for this team. We will win. We will win. You're not a leader. Amy, you're fired. She's pissed. The people that are involved in this interview process will do whatever it takes to lie, cheat, steal, stab people in the back just so they themselves can get ahead. Quite frankly, I almost believe that we could have won this task had I just ran the whole thing myself. Just told the whole damn team to go take a break and sit in the frickin' mansion, and I'll just go hire my own people and manage it myself, because they certainly weren't doing anything to help me out. Did she give you the eyes of death? Oh my yeah. god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> she got in the car, if she's turned around, and she's just like, she's gonna kill us. <laughs> when Amy got fired, she got let down to the car, she turned around, and she was just like...
and it scared the crap. It was like the ending of The Omen, where like a little kid is just driving away, and she gave me the look of the devil. Uh, it was like. And what is is this made of? Do you know? Wood. Jennifer, I'm curious, who would you bring back other than Angela? I assume you're going to bring back Angela. No, I was. Yeah, I would have brought back Derek with her. Well, okay, so I did your work. <laughs> So you want to bring back somebody else, or do you want to just bring back Angela? Why don't we just say Derek's fired? <laughs> we all did such a great job. You're not going to get off the hook. And honestly, no, no, was, you're not going to get off the hook. The was the big disaster. I'm not I think you really, really tried hard, but you did a lousy job, and you were a bad project manager, Jennifer. I don't want you to waste. I don't want to waste time. I mean, you could go back. You could take two people. Before you fire me, can you just get one thing? Because I know you're about to do it. <laughs> oh my gosh! You know what? Oh! Oh, 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 oh my god, the water is going everywhere, you guys! Hell, oh, it just touched me! Oh! It's the most miserable experience of my life! Oh! Oh, this is disgusting! I could scream! You guys, it's because they have passion. I was insanely excited to be on the set of one of my soap operas. I'm a huge Passions fan. Huge! I mean big! I mean huge! So Stacy answers the phone immediately, says, I gotta call you back. She thinks to herself, oh my god, the note. Right. The only thing is, guys, I can't use the Lord's name in vain. God said I could use it in vain, though. will never understand women. Look, is Angela a leader? A leader. Angela is not a... <laughs> you know what that is? You know what that is? That's Brooklyn. <laughs> a leader. It comes out every once in a while. <laughs> James and I had to go straight to the LA Times for the presentation because we just we didn't have time. And I'm still in pajamas because I don't have any other clothes. I think that Stephanie's going to bring clothes for you, you for sure. You know what else I could do if I have to? So I'm going to have a tie. I could put it around here. I could wear your jacket, you could just wear the green. How are you going to wear a tie with a t-shirt? No, no, it was looking like a bla- I buttoned the jacket. Do you see your shirt? You can't wear a freaking tie without a collar. True. That would look really, really bad. God, man. Well, at least we're not missing out on a really fantastic reward. Trip? No. I, I feel like I can't Go ahead. finish a sentence here. I'm going to be grayed out on the NBC website now. I hate that. I hate being grayed out. Oh my God. What? What the? What? 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 There was a mouse. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yes, there was. It's a little, little thing with it's dark tail. Out. How could you see He's dark mouse? and he's running that way. What? Start the fire immediately. Camp has become dilapidated, disgusting, dirty, and difficult to live in. I'm tired of living outside. You can come down now. You know, today we had wasps, we had mice, we had lizards. That's really bad. Yeah, it's really bad. Uh, I had a spider in my on. bed. Let's go put on pajamas on. Wait, 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 wait. I don't want to go low. Frank, I was going to go You're going to lie in front of him? No, I was going to touch on everything after the video. I said we need to play the the video sooner in the presentation. So if you were in charge of the presentation after the video was done, why didn't you give the presentation? Answer that question. The doctor does have to do more tests, but I'm going to do everything I can to make you feel more Uh, relaxed. Time out. Why don't we put the product in the background for recognition? Where would you like it? Hang on. When the executive showed up, Nicole did jump right up and uh, grab the Renews It bottle. We really didn't need a bottle in the scene we were shooting, but Nicole was trying to impress the Renews It executives, which was kind of funny. That shot is so important, that shows our product. It's big brownie points for that. So I'm just saying hi, thanks for stopping by. Let us know you guys.
our seats. We would like to thank the Renewsit Corporation for giving us the opportunity to work with this three-in-one special odor neutralizer. My dream is to uh, put up skyscrapers, so that's one. Those are two skyscrapers I would love to help you correct. Ivanka, do you have any questions? I want each of you to tell me which two people I should get rid of right now. Two people, not one. Frank and Nicole. Why am I shocked? <laughs> Why? Because I've worked with James from day one, and uh, I have uh, some degree of loyalty to James here. I've also seen not quite as stellar of a performance from Frank and Nicole. Yeah, but if I listen to you, I should just hire James right now. Actually, if you listen to me, you should hire me and let me hire James to work for me. <laughs>